Most people in life are looking at how do I make a life worth living in retirement worth having. In the time of COVID, we are covering our faces predominantly with a mask. We're also covering our heads when it's cold. We're covering our hands when it's freezing cold. And frankly, that's not the point of my cast. What I'm talking about is that we are not covered in the world like people think we are. A lot of people think that what they're doing is totally okay. The truth is that people are stupid about the law today. People are stupid about human rights today, and people are stupid about what they say today. They often mouth off to someone that could get them into trouble for their lies, saying, I'm doing this to him, and I'm doing that to them, because I'm in power over them. And that is a lie. You are sitting in Stupidville. Stupidville is someone who believes they are above the law. Stupidville is someone who thinks, I can just twist this person's arm, I can just keep pushing and pushing and pushing until they lose their charm, and I can just keep doing whatever the hell I want to because I wanna. I'm sorry, you're not five years old anymore if you're an adult, and openly you know what the boundaries of the world are. Where your boundaries begin and end are with you, not somebody else. You are in control of your choices. If you choose to break the law, then you are choosing the consequences of breaking the law. If you choose to harm someone physically, then you are choosing the consequences of those things. The rage, the violence, the molestations, the mutilations, and possibly the rape. Sexual assault is something that still happens on campuses. A lot of times people don't realize they've even been assaulted because of new technologies coming in from Middle East and Asian and Mexican nations. You see, that's the scary thing about technology when we don't have the right to talk about the truth of new technologies. Audio technology has been around a long time. Subliminal technology has also been around a very long time. But when we stay here and when we play here in America, we have to follow the laws. They begin with the treaties of our nation with the rest of the world. Human Rights Declaration is a huge treaty throughout the world. We also have the Constitution and Amendments and those things protect our rights. Beyond that, we have a shitload of federal laws that take care of just about everything that's related to an adult human being throughout their beginning to end of life. When I'm talking about these things, I'm not talking about stupid things. I'm not talking about Stupidville. I'm talking about truth of life. That when you go to school, you're creating a record. That record is your educational record, your GPA, and what classes you passed, what classes you failed, and what classes did you excel in. Because your major can be handled by a lot of classes, but what your specialty is, what's going to make you a living, is something else altogether. In life, we have moments of time to tell people what is real and how we feel. But if we avoid doing that because we're too immature, then you're sitting in Stupidville. Stupidville says, I'm going to do what I feel like I can do, but I don't care about anyone else. I don't care about their feelings. I don't care about their opinions. I don't care. Well, what kind of marvelous for you? Unfortunately, the world is made up of people, and we have to learn how to get along with people. We have to learn how to not piss people off. We have to learn how to not get people to want to take revenge on us later in life because we've been, well, a little odd. In life, we have moments of time to say that wearing a mask can make your nose awfully itchy, itchy, but that's not the point. The point is that people are real and they are acting transparently. Giving people information is what we do in the news world, in the media world, and in the, well, educational world. We teach people new ideas, we teach people new technologies, we teach people new strategies, and we teach people new marketing ideas for them. But if you're screwing your life, playing around with someone else's life because you got nothing else better to do, then you're not even thinking about your own life. What you're promoting is that you are a power-hungry person who doesn't know the rules of life.